I'm going to walk you through how to use Microsoft Teams to record a presentation. So here I am in the Teams application. If you don't have this open, you're going to want to go to Start or find your desktop icon. You're going to need to open up Microsoft Teams. And then you want to head to your calendar. So inside of the calendar, I have this option to Meet Now. And that's exactly what I want. I'm just going to click Meet Now. Meet Now. You can change this if you want. You could put presentation, whatever you feel is the best label. Get link to share or just start the meeting. The reason I click start meeting is I'm going to be recording me, right? This is a presentation. Here's the video and ooh, that's not great, but there it is. Use audio and that is all looking good. Join now. I'm not going to invite people to be in this meeting. Now to record, I'm going to go ahead before sharing my screen, I'm going to go ahead and do joop. And you do want to check that you have an audio device enabled headphones. That's fine. Microphone. And you can see that I'm talking here. So mine is working. Let me hit X on that. Let me go here into settings. Make sure you're logged into your school account or the account that has access to the full version of teams and the teams app. I'm going to hit start recording. I'm going to then hit share right away and kapow. Now I am sharing my screen and I'm currently recording. Let me go ahead and make sure I hit presentation view. Look at my cool example presentation. This is my example presentation. Look, Cambridge Public Gallery. I'm giving an example presentation. More info, more info, and more info. Neat. Great. So now at this point, I'm going to go ahead and click this stop sharing button. I'm going to go up here and click stop recording as well. A recording is being saved. The recording is stopped. You can find the link to the meeting to the recording in the chat history. All right. So I'll turn off my camera for now while that gets loaded in. And then here is the meetings right here. I can right click on this. I could open it in OneDrive. I could get the link directly. If I copy that link, copy, Pada, I have magic my way to that link. So to access the link, you would just copy it up here and you paste it and boom, this is where it took me. Now I have the option of downloading the link and either sending it to someone. I might have to upload it to Google Drive or OneDrive before sending it, but I could download the video file directly. I also have the option of in OneDrive itself, if I use, if I had access to a OneDrive link, going to here. And then the priority on this is the sharing access. So if you were to open it up, you want to make sure, again, similar access. You want to make sure you click share and check who will have access. View only access. Because if other people cannot see and access this file, then, well, your recording isn't exactly useful. And ta-da! You now have an incredible recording of your presentation all through Teams.